Hello everybody and welcome to another toy review. This is Chance Ichio and today we are reviewing the Marvel Legends series, Marvel's Vision. We'll take a look at the packaging and here is Vision. Let's try and focus. This is definitely the classic Vision from the old comics, not the movie Vision. Not to say that I wouldn't have been happy with the movie Vision, but... This is what I got. If you remember from my uh, Toys R Us toy hunt, you saw me pick this guy up from the store. Here's Marvel Legends, Hasbro. Marvel Legends, a nice picture of the vision up top. Here's some uh, info here. You know, number one pet. I never thought of the vision as a pet but also says you should recycle him with that arrow pattern around it, which I shall not do. Maybe the packaging, but not him. Here's a nice pose of the vision. Also look for in different languages, and you see others you can get in this line. Armored Spider-Man, Gamora, Living Laser, Marvel's Rage, Daredevil, and Ant-Man. Each sold separately. Baby sad, because he can't play with these. Warning symbols, talking about why he can't play with them. Here's a bio, a synthetic humanoid vision manipulates his density to deliver strength and resistance to any matchup. And the same thing in the... in different languages. And with that, we shall open him up. So there's tape sealing him on the back, so we'll just try and... Open up the tape there. Okay, so there we go. Just get that tape that I broke off, but hopefully I we can just do it the rest of the way like that. Come on. Don't fight me on this. I'll put this down because I'll need both hands from the looks of it. That's it. There, that's a very sticky tape. Try not to spend too much time opening this. Oh, there we go. And there, and oh, just pull out this, and there he is. He's obnoxiously in there. I probably should have opened him up ahead of time, but oh well. <laughs> That's how the cookie crumbles sometimes. Oh, broke this. That's okay, I'll get his hand out of there, and his other hand out of there, and his capes in this thing. So I'll just cut his legs out like this, and he cut them like there, and just get his cape out like this. May have to bend it a bit to, uh, it's a softish plastic, so it won't be that bad. But they got it in real tight. Good. Almost got it. There. There. Hope I didn't damage the tape, but just, but yeah, it looks okay. So here he is. I'll string him out. Take a closer look at him. I'll just stand that packaging up there. Get a look at his head sculpt. Yeah, he has the black eyes with the single yellow dot, though the dot's more uh, well painted on one side than the other. It's that painted jewel on there, and he has the jewel on his head, the classic red face. He has the big cape that the classic look's known for. Well, he's just green with yellow glove parts and the yellow bit here. Plastic cape's nicely detailed. It just bends like this, and back you can see the detail continues on. It's like, does he have anything on the bottoms of his feet? Yep. Made in China. 
So his articulation, his head goes this way and that. He gets on a ball joint. Though his cape hinders it, but that's okay. He can still get some good movement and its bendiness gives some leeway. Arms go like this. They can go out like that. This on a hinge here. Nothing at the wrists. Nothing at the waist, but the legs can go like that. Like out like this. This and the knees bend on a double hinge and feet are on that same weird hinge that Machine Man had in that other video I did. There he is. That's Marvel's Legend series, Marvel's Vision. Let's put him right here. Yeah, I think he's a good toy. Out of the box, he's good. I'll definitely put him with the rest of my toys, and I hope he'll look good with... Them. Yeah, he will look good with them. So, yeah. I like him. I like having a classic vision. You know, I'm reflecting in the plastic. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed this review, and I thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.